Hi, in this video today, I want to show you how to get the connection string from accessing file when you are working with .NET Core. Okay, so now, let's get started. I will open the Visual Studio on my PC. The current version I'm using is 2019. Okay, so here I will click on Create a New Project on the right hand. In the search box, I will type in web. After that, it will filter the project regarding to the website. Okay. And here I have a ASP.NET Core web application. I will select this one. Click on next. I will enter the name for this project. So I will enter it in getting, getting Connection string from app setting. Okay, demo. And then I will change the location of this to save this project. And, and, and then click, click on the career button here. In this step, I will select the web application model view controller. Project is creating. Okay. So now here, I will open the app setting dot sun file. So here I have a. Uh, I will create a new key here. I will name it a con connection string. And then provide the value for this for connection string. I will. I have um my connection string. It will be the okay. And let me open another project and copy the connection string. Okay, I put it here. Okay, and save it. This, assuming this connection string is correct for now. Okay, so now here I will open the controller in the home. So, firstly, I will create a new property. We have private only. I have I connection. I will have a I configuration sorry okay I will add some reference for this it will be using the Microsoft dot extension dot configuration okay and then next step I will create the an, a contractor. I will remove this one. A contractor. Okay, and then I will assign the value is this. Those configuration equal config. Okay, and then in the index action here i will do some detecting here i will create a new var connection string equal configuration dot get connection string okay so here you need to enter the key value the key connection the same connection string key here in order to get the value from the my connection string okay i put it value here okay and now i will have some the breakpoint here for testing I'll run this one yeah so now here it has run in into other 
breakpoint and I will try to debug this one press the F10 on my keyboard here yeah. so now we check the value of the connection here yeah. open this one okay you see here for now the value of the connection string has been here has been accepted here okay continue okay so i think that's all for today this is very basic content in this video but i think it will be helpful for everyone in this of hard coding the connection string in the uh, controller or something like that you don't need to do some configuration in the app setting file yeah and of course when you do any configuration in the app setting or uh, it could be easier for you to manage it later on okay okay again thank you i hope this video will have fun for you if you think this is helpful like share and subscribe my youtube channel okay thank you bye bye and see you guys in the next video